What's up? Kumusta mong tanan? Welcome to our another session. Today is our bike check session with this beautiful bike. This is the Transition Patrol 2021 in aluminum frame. We have a chance to bike check this uh, beautiful bike. This bike is not mine. This bike is owned by Sir Lance de la Victoria. So thank you Sir Lance for giving us a chance to do a bike check session with your beautiful patrol. Since I got interested in biking industry or biking hobby, um, this is my dream frame. Lahat naman tayo siguro is gusto magkaroon ng full suspension bike and this is my dream bike and I'm happy that I have a chance to bike check this beautiful bike. So let's go. First, let's check the components of the cockpit. So the cockpit area is composed of fat bar, 35mm aluminum handlebars paired with rental apex with 35mm clamping and for the grips, this bike got with Daiti lock-on grips. For the saddle, we have the Oi Oi DMR saddle paired with um, Fox Transfer Kashima coat with 150mm travel with also Fox remote and for the headset along with this bike when you buy this frame set meron na itong kasamang headset at seat clamp and the headset is zero stock 56 56 56 in the upper tube and 56 in the lower tube this is the major upgrade of the transition patrol ginawa nilang zero stock na straight head tube para maging compatible ito sa dual crown fork for those rider who want to get into downhill mountain biking so compatible siya for the dual crown forks so it has a massive head tube. So makikita nyo naman napakalaki ng kanyang head tube. And for the seat clamp, and I guess the brand of the um, seat clamp, if I'm not mistaken, is also the transition. And let's go to the brake set. The brake set of this bike is Jory XT M812, the latest version of XT quad piston paired with centerline SRAM 203 rotors, rear and front. And now let's go for the suspension of the bike. Um, this bike is rocking the Fox 38 170mm of travel in 27.5 with grip to damper. So meron itong low and high speed compression and rebound adjuster for high and low rebound. And let's go to the rear shock. So this frame comes with the Fox Float X2 rear shock, 160 travel. So this bike is um, also the major upgrade of the Transition Patrol because pwede mo itong gawing smallet setup na pwede mo siyang gawing to 29er in front and 27.5 in the back. So this bike is yung tinatawag nilang Kashima Coat Trifecta. Is yung tatlong components ng bike is coated with Kashima Coat from fork, um, dropper post, and the rear shock. So let's go to the drivetrain of the bike. This bike has a NX Eagle SRAM with 12 speed group set and with the pedals it has the DMR7 composite pedals. For the chain ring it's a 32 teeth size chain ring with 12 speed chain in NX SRAM Eagle. Also the derailleur it's a 12 speed NX SRAM Eagle. And for the wheel set of the bike, front of the bike is rocking the 27.5 Asigai with Exo Terra um, protection and for the rear tire, um, this bike bike has the uh, Minion DHR 27.5 with also XO3C protection. And for the hubs, they're using the Bitex hubs, lace with pillar spokes and brass nipples. And for the rims, um, this bike has the Dartmoor Shield 27.5 wide and that's it. I guess that's the components of the bike. For the whole frame, one of the major upgrade in this bike, also the um, switch flip in the rear shock so you can um, adjust to high and low so for the low you can stay with the head tube angle of 63 millimeters angle and when you switch to the high position of the rear shock um, you can make your head tube more slacker with 0.5 millimeter so it will be 63.5 millimeter head tube angle transition makes the newer geometry of the bike they call it the speed balance geometry the speed balance geometry ensures the bike maintains low speed agility front wheel traction and proper rider weight balance while actually increasing the confidence in steep terrain and high speeds with sbg a slacker head tube 
tube angle is combined with all new reduced offset fork standard, preventing the front wheel from being too far in front of the rider. This improves the front to rear weight distribution of the bike, which is often out of balance on long and slack bikes. On the SBG's greatest benefit is that it creates a confident steering feel that adapts to the wheel speed. One of SBG's greatest benefits is that it creates a confident steering feel that adapts to wheel speed. More stability when going fast, more agility on technical slow speed maneuvering, as well as improved traction, control, and confidence for any skill level of their rider. So makikita nyo sa website lahat ng details tungkol sa frame and about the frame features. It has the lifetime warranty, GU adjust chip, size specific chainstay, pivot technology, frame protection, enduro max bearings, gear accessory mount, dual crown for compatibility, tire clearance, press in headset. And for the suspension, the geometry of the bike is called the Giddy Up Suspension by Transition. So makikita nyo rin dito sa website kung ano yung Giddy Up Suspension design. So if you want um, very deaf reviews about this bike, so you can check the website of Transition. Nandun na lahat ng details at kung ano ang mga binago nila sa geometry ng frame for the Patrol 2021 and all the transition bikes model nandoon na lahat ng details so hindi kayo mahirapan kung pipili kayo ng um, geometry or size ng bike when i dream about my frame so nakita ko yung transition spire the 29er with 170 um, rear shock so napakaganda nun kasi 29 and 170 of travel so when i test this bike so i'm a 29er rider so nakita ko talaga yung difference kasi napakataas ng tindig ng 29 at kapag nakaupo ka kahit naka lower yung um, saddle mo so malaki talaga yung kaibahan from the ground and nakasakay ka sa bike when I try this um, bike with 27.5 of size napaka konti lang ng clearance towards the ground hindi ko pa siya na, na try sa trail eh, pero kung for me mas malapit siya sa ground uh, mas madali siyang i-maneuver kung sa mga steep at technical areas. So that's my um, opinion. Maybe you have a different opinion, but for me, um, riding this bike, I guess um, yun yung napinaganda ng 27.5. So maganda siyang dalhin sa technical and steep trails. Thank you for watching for this bike session. Shout out to Tapchon. Shout out Tio. And this bike is built by Tio of Tapchon Cycle House. Thank you for watching and coming in this bike session. And I hope you do subscribe, like, and share. And comment kung ano ang inyong masasabi sa build na ito. I'm nakaredy na po yung giveaway natin. Sana tulungan nyo ako makareach ng 500 or 1,000 para ma-monetize na yung channel natin. As always, keep the trails clean. Maraming salamat. Ingat and bye-bye.